and we're back with the Opie and Anthony show. Thanks for checking us out. Our buddy's on the line. We haven't talked to him on the radio since we got uh, syndicated, Anthony. Yes, this is the first uh, exposure of uh, Andrew Dice Clay to the national market. Andrew Dice Clay. Hello? It's the Dice Man. Dice. Talk up, I can't hear you. You can't hear us, really? Somebody yeah, it's hard to try. hear you. No one else is having a problem today. The Cleveland is. <laughs> yeah, well. <laughs> yeah, I heard about that. All right, can you hear us now? Uh, uh, yeah, I can hear you pretty good. All right, what's up? You're here yeah, right how you guys doing? Pretty good. All right, you know, things going on. No, I know, and I actually wish uh, I uh, I was calling under better circumstances. Yeah. You know, and, you know, the first thing uh, I have to say is, I mean, we all know what an awful tragedy this is and how horrible it is, and I personally want to say, how my heart goes out to all the families and, and the firemen and the policemen that that have lost people. You know, it, it's just a terrible thing. Inconceivable, this whole thing. It, it is inconceivable. Yeah. But what what you have to remember is that, you know, this country has been built on such a strong foundation, you know, and when you have a strong foundation like we have, you could really carry a lot on your shoulders. And even though this is an awful thing, I mean, everybody is is going to do that job. Oh, yeah. I mean, just like the firemen have been doing and the police. And uh, obviously, uh, New York has the greatest mayor in the history of New York. Giuliani's done a great job. He's shown leadership. Yeah, certainly shown Amazing. that. Amazing. Right. I mean, these people are heroes. They're courageous. I mean, just all the volunteers. Everybody wants to be part of this. And, and, and uh, Dice, don't forget about the dogs. The, the who? The dogs down there. Yeah, and all the dogs. Oh, no, are, I'm serious. No, you know. What do you mean the dogs? There's dogs down there. They got there. the dogs down there. They're uh, yeah, trying to search for people. You know the rescue dogs. They 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 you know they have that thing under their neck. You know. All right. Well, the dogs don't understand the English, so they dogs. don't see what I'm trying to say. What? Dice. Right. Are you wearing a big leather jacket with the American flag studs on? Yeah, the back? I got my I got my American flag jacket. You got that one? Yeah. I, I always liked that one. You know. You know. I I I just want to get this across to you. Okay. You know, because you know, I, you know, I'm, I'm listening Guys, to. A, we're not making any jokes. Seriously, the, the, there's a lot of dogs down there, and a lot of people are pissed off that the dogs aren't getting, you know, the attention. Oh, so you're not kidding me? No. Well, feed the dog. They, 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 well, they didn't have dog food, so then uh, they put a word out on the radio, and they started collecting dog uh, food for the dogs, and then uh, they need a little. Little, uh, what, Anthony? Little the Scorch Fund. They needed, like, uh, dog booties, and we got them that, too, because they were calling around in the rubble, uh, cutting their little paws. Well, that's good. Yeah. Yeah, but, you know, but... we're kidding. We're not kidding. I know you're goofing on me. You know, I'm trying to call in Dice. and be serious about something. I'm getting ready to hit somebody in the face with a pipe. <laughs> Dice, calm down. You know what I mean? Dice, calm down. First of all, we're not kidding with you. That's just one of the things that's going on. But you know what? Even if, even if you are kidding, I, I think that's important because I think at this point, you know, everybody, you know, besides, uh, you know, all, all, the, all the volunteers and firemen and police have to do that job and if you guys are kidding that's okay because that's what your job is and and i think your job is also to lift and help you know lift the spirits uh, of the city and the country right you know and one one of the reasons i'm calling in is because i would like to do a thing with you guys which is uh you know i hope we could do this which would be a radio telethon a 24 hour Radio telethon. 24 hours? 24 hours where we get all kinds of entertainment, not just comedians, rock stars, performers that'll talk, maybe politicians, and raise all this money to give to these families and, and the police and everybody that needs it immediately. This is a We Are New York emergency telethon. And, you know, I, I would like everybody involved in this. And, of course, I want to do this with you guys. And, you know, even thinking about it, you know, and I hope I'm not going over the line here. Mm -hmm. You know, I know in the past 
I have had problems with Howard Stern. You guys have had problems with him. But I have no more problems with him. Oh, yeah? Because all the nonsense that, that we, we do all year long, all the petty nonsense goes right out the window now. Everybody is friends. This is the time that I feel that everybody has to get together and unite because that's what we are. You know, this is the United States. This is, you know, the, the, the greatest country in the world. And even though this thing happened in New York and in Washington, we are all connected. And that's what makes us the United States. And this thing that happened, in my opinion, in the greatest city, in the greatest country in the world, you know, has to be taken care of. You know, and I don't like when I hear people saying, uh, you know, we were a great country. Let me tell you something. We were, we are, and always will be the greatest country ever. Uh, you know. Bravo. And, you know, I, I just want to say this, and, and then we could talk about whatever you want, because, you know, I mean, you, you know what happened is awful, and it's something that, you know, we never thought would happen to us, but it did, and it hurts. And, you know, and people can't make sense of it. And that was the intentions of these animals that did this, to knock us down animals. and keep us down. Right. But let me tell you something. That could never happen because New Yorkers, whether you're from the boroughs or New York City or upstate New York, have the spirit and more heart than all of these third world garbage countries put together anywhere. Amen. This whole country of ours will now bond together, and, and I think we'll rise to the occasion. Nice. It took you a week for the speech. You no, I'm, I'm, I'm just trying to say it from my heart. You know, no, I'm we, 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 you in the mouth. In a Let second. me tell you something. We were in here on uh, Tuesday and Wednesday uh, uh, last week, and uh, a lot of the same sentiments coming from a lot of people. And now you're calling. It's uh, it's over a week later. And no. uh, now you got well, the. I went to the call when I knew you would be on the air, and a lot of people would be listening. All right. And I knew that the day or two after, there wouldn't be that many people listening. Right. You know, I mean, but you know what? I, you know, I am from that city. You know that. I'm yeah. from I'm from Brooklyn, and and stop playing the music. You, you know what I mean? Yeah. If you you got to stop playing the music, really. I'm gonna get mad. I think it's a nice background. You know, well, I, I'm having a hard time thinking when you do this. Nice. It's the national anthem. Yeah, we're feeling it right now. Come on. No, I'm Go just ahead. trying to say something to you. This is the one time I'm calling in, you know, uh, serious, and, and you're jerking me around here. No, well, you know, I liked what you were saying, so we figured a nice background music for it. All right, well, shut it off. Anthony. Yeah. Anthony with the button. I don't have a button. I'm not playing this. What do you want? What do, you, what do I got to give you, jokes? No, I'm not going to go into that now. I liked what you were saying. Continue talking about the filthy animals. No, well, well, yeah, but, all right, why can't they teach driver's ed and sex ed in that third world country? It's too hard on the camel. I mean, what kind of jokes? There you go. What do you call a what do you call a chink and a jack driving around in a Trans Am? The gooks are hazard. <laughs> you know, I mean, what do you want? What's better than ten fingers on a piano, two lips around my organ? We're not doing jokes today. <laughs> you know what I mean? Oh, I like that. No, I'm just trying to talk about this thing. <laughs> I'm hanging up. No, don't. I'm hanging up. I don't, want to talk about this telephone. Don't hang up. All right. Now you're you know, going to be you know, like... what? you know, you think it's a big joke. Yeah, no. Yeah, but, but you got all these kids out there. I'm not talking. I'm hanging yeah. up. No, Dice, don't hang up. I'm hanging up. You, you got me mad. It's almost over. You can't cut it off in the middle. It's the national anthem. So it's almost done. Anyway. Listen to this note. This is from the uh, Chicago uh, Yankee yeah, game. Was... Last night, where Mrs. Butterworth got up and sang that great version of uh, the Star Spangled Banner on National Anthem. There we go. All right, guys. You know something? You guys are morons, no matter what. Well, I'll stop it. You're just morons. Stop it. We thought it was appropriate. You, you know, know I always call in as a dummy, and I do stupid stuff. I'm trying to say something. No, we know. don't say that to your face. <laughs> Never. <laughs> Dice, let, let, me, let me ask you something. Either of you guys got kids yet? Dice, you Hell were being no. very patriotic, and we just thought... Do any of you guys have it? kids yet? Uh, to not. date, oh! <laughs> 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 you know what? 
you know what? It's good that you're doing this. <laughs> All right, you're making me lose, too, because you know what? All right, come I on. I got to be honest. I was a little uptight about calling in because I wanted to, you know, say something really good. Yeah. Till you wrecked it. No, no, we didn't, <laughs> we didn't wreck anything. Wreck we you know, you, I'm just making guys, a point. I think hold you on, hold a on. Great point. Hold on, let's regroup, okay? All right, no, we're, we're okay. Wait, here. we didn't, we didn't wreck anything. I, this radiothon sounds like a great idea. What Anthony and I have been going uh, for the last few days is a few chuckles. So that was a little chuckle. No, no, and that's just right. Little, that's just why leave I, a little steam, a little. That's tension. why I gave you the chink joke. All right. Well, we were hoping it would, you know, make someone chuckle. You know, you started in with the dogs. You, you the know dog, I mean? Hold on, hold on, and that's true. Hold on, hold on. Hey, hey, oh, hey. Oh, oh, oh. Hey, where, where do you find the dog with no legs? Hold on, right where you left them. I mean, you want dog jokes? <laughs> Wait, I'm putting you on uh, with Melissa for a second because uh, you you have to believe this, Melissa. Hi. Hi, uh, Andrew Dice Clay's on the on the line live from L.A. I was, um, I volunteered Friday night at the Armory for four hours, and one of the things that we're requesting that people send in is dog food and the booties. So that the dogs have stuff. They're not BSing you. They're telling you the truth. All right. Well, you know what? If there's no dog food around, give them regular food. Yeah. You can't know that they're dogs can eat regular food. You just don't want them to eat regular food because it's more expensive. No, I just don't like give my dog regular food. And and trying to help out. You know what? You throw a mistake. Right. Who's looking? All right. Well, what anyway? All right, Melissa. Well, getting, it's, it, Owen and right, and I just want to say to Owen, they thank you very much because one of my, my company was in one of the buildings. I got hit there. Okay. Yeah. There she goes. I think with the more. Uh, Melissa, you're breaking up, so I'm going to let you go. Up. All right, uh, Dice, enough with the chuckles. So, yeah, I mean, who's Melissa? I mean, what am I even talking? Was she good to go? No, she, no she's no. a listener. And, it's uh, funny, you really don't believe us on the on the dog thing. We have a... We have she a, sounded hot. I think you're playing with me. We have a radio friend. I got a dose of kiwi cream for her. We have a radio friend up in... Uh, where Where is, uh, of course, Utica, Syracuse? We never know where yeah. he broadcasts from. And he's, no, uh, I and just he's, called him because I, I think we should okay, put look, this telethon together. Uh, it's a radiothon. Right. Yeah, a radio thon. Right. Tell you know, because I, I, I just think, um, you know, we need to a encourage each other at this point, right. you know, and help each other. And, you know, you know, e even more important than, um, you know, what we're doing now, you know, the future of these children that have lost loved ones, you know, are, are going to have to you know, live with this. And by us doing this kind of telethon, you know, these things will be remembered. And I think, you know, it, it's just our way of even more than giving the money. Yeah. You know, it, it's our way of showing that, that we care about them and we love them. You know what I mean? So, uh, because radio this, this, was, this was just the most awful thing that has ever happened. And this is our country. And this is, you know, a country, you know, where, where, you know, anybody has been free to pursue any dream and reach any goal. Mm -hmm. And where kids go to school and when they graduate school, they're free to pursue whatever dream they want to go after. Mm -hmm. But most important, what I feel is that the beauty of this country is that we have always had freedom without fear. Even to midgets. Do you, do you understand what I'm saying to you? Yes. And, and don't be stupid. Why? Because, well, well, the president and the military do their job. It's our job now to, to bring entertainment uh, to people. All right, so how does, and, and make them laugh. How, how does this radiothon, uh, how is it going to work, Dice? I don't know. You're the big brains. Who's, who's going to be like the Jerry Lewis guy? Well, I, I'll be on the West Coast. You'll be on the East Coast. You could be like Jerry. I, I think we could set it up. It, you Don't look, make me get stupid. You look, because when I get stupid, I, I lose it. You look more like Jerry than we do. You could be like the well, actually, lady. <laughs> see, there you go. Lady. Did you see Jerry this year? You'll never walk alone. <laughs> oh! You know, coming out singing that song, na 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 na. So you'll be uh, Jerry Lewis. Can we have Jerry Lewis had all the dog food. That's why they couldn't find any. Can we have a toad? What happened to you him? You fat son of a bitch. What oh. happened to Jerry? I, I actually know. thought it was a, a fat guy impersonating Jerry. Yeah, that's what he looks like now. You know, and I'm not looking to make fun of Jerry. I love Jerry. All right, so you're... But they went wrong. You're, you're Jerry Lewis. Who, who well, what, is he eating those kids? We, we get it. We heard those. Did you really? Yeah. Somebody steal my jokes. I can't believe this. Yeah, fourth grade. There's something new. <laughs> <laughs> 
Yeah, so go ahead. What, what were you saying? All right, so you're Jerry Lewis, Ant and I, who are we? Who's like Ed McMahon? Uh, who's Ed like, McMahon? All I'm right. Paul Anka. You're going to be Paul Anka? Doesn't he, doesn't he do it? All right, you could be like Wayne Newton or something. All right, so yeah. how, how is this thing going to work? We, we, we do 24 we set, up, we set up a studio on the West Coast. We do 24 straight hours. You're with us the whole we time? We do 24 straight hours. Or are you going to uh, uh, pull a Jerry Lewis on us and do five minutes here, five minutes there? I need to know. Yeah, we do the 24 hours. We're bringing all kinds of uh, Anthony. Yeah. Believe me, if I was there, I would have to break your wrist. <laughs> well, 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 I would no. just have to do karate on you. We're having fun, right, guys? We're having fun, but, you know, we're trying to set this thing up. Yeah. You know. All right, what's your big idea, Anthony? I don't have one. All right. I have no idea. Talk, talk, Dice. Dumb as milk, this guy. I, I, All right, what do you feel? I thought I'm a moron. I know. All right. What do you think? What do I think about what? I think we should steal a van and sit on a billboard. <laughs> No, that's an idea. All right, go ahead, Dice. Dice wants to be. What serious. should we do? Yeah, no, I'm telling you what work? we have to do. All right, well, you got a studio out on the West Coast. We got no, one. You got to get me one. You're with a big radio station. How are we gonna uh, get? And we'll get the talent. My how, agents. How do we get the talent? Well, well, my agents are really gonna help with that. You know, they got a lot of. Uh, you know, they got a lot of big talent. You know, who, who would you like on the show? Oh, who do you got? We'll try to get Metallica. Uh, uh, Tower uh, Top would be nice. You know, we we uh, they got Billy Joel. They got everybody. Oh, yeah. You know, stop with the music. It's very confusing to a mind like mine. Gallagher? Can we get Gallagher to smash? We'll get a lot of comics. We'll get some one and one man today. I uh, no, Jim's not here. What happened? I spoke to him late last night. He said he's coming down there. That's, he's around here somewhere. Well, where is he? I don't know. He's not in the studio. What, is he analyzing women's urine? Where is he? <laughs> I don't know where he is. I'm serious. You know? You got you to gotta stop with the music, really. <laughs> Jimi Hendrix. I know who it is. Oh. We can play this as we go to the tote board. Okay. Well, you know what? Let's go Let's to the tote, the tote board. When do you think we could do something like I that? I want to thank the McDonald's Corporation for their generous check. You stupid ass. Oh, we're going to get all the celebrities. You know, you turn the golden arches upside down, it looks like a big yellow ass. My joke. <laughs> That's another one of my jokes. Can we get Yakov? Yakov Smirnov? We're going to get everybody. What the country. I, th I think once we announce this, a lot of people want to be involved in it. Can we get Paula Poundstone to fondle a child? Well, if we can't, you got Norton sitting there. <laughs> Shut the music. This is a great version. How much heroin did Jimmy have in his system during this? How much heroin was pumping through Jimmy? All right. Obviously, you don't want to do this. Why? Well, we we want to do something to help. I think uh, Radio Dong is a good idea. You, you think it could work out? Well, they're doing a TV uh, telethon Friday, right? Yeah, all the networks. I don't know what they're doing on TV. All Who's doing a TV all, telethon? All the networks getting together to simulcast a huge... Uh, uh, better okay, well, how are they going to do that when it's all different channels? They're a bunch of idiots. But <laughs> they're going to get uh, Tom Hanks. Well, of course, and, you know. And, uh, He's been in war for the last 30 years already. Britney Spears, I believe. Yeah, do we get uh, Britney Spears on our radio thumb? Yeah, maybe. Ooh. She's nice, right? Nice. 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 But, but we got to move on this thing. All right, so where do we go from here? I don't know. It's your radio station. This is what I keep saying to you. We got to set a date. We got to start getting the count. Roll with that. Roll with that. So, guys, what are you saying? You'd be willing to go on a station that we supply out on the West Coast. And for 24 hours, if I could use the term, you're going to put yourself out there. <laughs> and and uh, be with us and raise some money. That's right. Set the music, Anthony. I swear, when I see you, I'm just going to choke you to death. See, I'm going to get choked by guys for something I'm not doing. Would I turn music up this loud if I was playing it and I'm trying to talk? Yeah. Really? So much for you. Jimmy still had the needle hanging out of his arm playing this. I think he used it as a slide on the flipboard. Amazing. I like Dyson's idea. 
I like it too. Guys, you mind if we do it though without you? Hello? That is the big hang up. Guys. I'm not talking to you now. Oh, oh, see, now you're playing games. No, I'm mad at you now. Now you're playing games. I'm mad. How can you be mad at a time like this? I'm mad. I haven't called in. I call with something good. Yeah, it's a very good idea. You know what I mean? We like it. We're just as suspicious. You're going to be up for 24 What do you mean suspicious? Don't be suspicious. What? You know what? The people listening, if they think it's a goof, it's not going to turn out the way we want. No, it's not that. It's uh, You're going to be up for 24 straight hours. Yes. It's nothing new to me. I haven't slept in 18 years. Look at me. Is this like the dice that we saw as the postal worker on that Fox uh, TV series a few years back? What are, you, what are you talking about? I mean, this is a sensitive, serious dice. You know, I'm, you know something? With what happened, you know... Uh, Hickory dickory dog, Bin Laden can suck my... Ow! You know? <laughs> You're going to do some different... Yeah, the one wrong? thing those people did do smart... Yeah. You see that women had a covered, like, with handkerchiefs, giant handkerchiefs? <laughs> right. And they never schooled, and they just used as bang puppets. <laughs> That's bang the only thing puppet. they ever did smart in that country. Bang puppets. Bill, I like yeah, one. Bang puppets. I can't say the F word. Bill, you, 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 oh, one I, of your rules. All right, Bill, Bill <laughs> on line one loves Dice's radio thong idea. Do you, do you think, um... Radio what? thong? Like a thong? What are you th talking about, the bang puppets? No, you said radio thong. Do you see those women? <laughs> you ever see their heads? Yeah. I yeah. mean, no, they're always wrapped up. Yeah, let's see them headless. <laughs> Anything with hair on it. Anything with hair on it. Hey, people are already pledging money, so uh, you're onto something. No, I'm telling you something. This, you know, it, it'll be the first radio thong ever. Thong? Not thong. Radio thong. Radio thong. I, you know what? Call it a radio thong. Have some filthy slobs come in. Have them, have them move some... Uh, so, you know what I mean? Radio tongue. Radio tongue, ta tongue, tongue, tongue. <laughs> That'd be like we leave girls, you know what I mean? People are loving the idea. They're, they're yeah, yeah. I mean, you know. I, I, we just feel like we're, we're going to do all the work, though. And you just. No, you're not going to do all the work. I'm going to be there. All right. Well, everybody but, but, is but, down. Don't we got to raise the truck, spirit. Truck. That's oh. what I'm talking about. Radio tongue. You know, and you're not going to get me off this. What? You know. I mean, I, I'm just a, as down as you guys are. Yeah, I see how down you are. Which way, radio or tongue? <laughs> <laughs> Which way, Bosco or you bad? You, you bad. bad. Right. That's right. <laughs> Which way, paper or plastic? Paper. No. <laughs> That's plastic. Which way, paper or plastic? It's, al it's always plastic. No, it's not. Oh. What Which is it? Paper or plastic? Plastic. No. Who cares? So what do you mean, who cares? I hate paper. No, I thought that was the answer. Who cares? No, no, that's not who cares. Oh. Who cares is a whole different bit. <laughs> oh, I see. Who cares? Got Which a... way, medium or well done? Uh, medium. No. Yeah, medium rare. <laughs> right. Of course it's medium rare. <laughs> All right, did we go through this? Now if you want to play, we could play. All right, so we we like the radio thong idea. Are people calling in? They like the idea? People like oh, the idea. I like pissed at you for goofing on it. No one's yeah, goofing on you guys on are morons. It. No one's goofing on the idea. We're goofing on you. You know, how many markets are you in? Can we raise about 30 million overnight? You think so? In 24 hours? Yeah. If you bring your Hollywood uh, friend. You, you think Howard would do this with us? Uh, no. Are you willing to let bygones be bygones? Uh, no. no. <laughs> yes. No. no. Yeah, that's what it's all about. What, being phony? No, we, we yeah. have to all see whatever you gotta be. We have to all raise the money we want to raise for this. We gotta make like we're friends. We are friends. There is no more fighting. No more fighting. We love fighting with you. No more fighting. We love fighting with you. No, not with me. Oh. There was an old Muslim lived in a shoe. <laughs> <laughs> Had so many children, her uterus fell out. Oh! <laughs> What's gonna happen? It's starting to happen. Are you going to sing any songs? Uh, yeah, I'm going to sing. Boogaloo, 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 I'm over here now. <laughs> and then the new Nun Nun song, which I gave you a preview of. Right. Yeah. Uh, all right. Can you sing that song? The Nun Nun song? Yeah. I forgot. Na, 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 na.
Does she sound retarded? Well, wait, he, he might have been getting to something there. What do you mean retarded? Go with it a little You're bit. You're allowed to make fun of retarded people. If you went over to a retarded person and said, hey, are you retarded? Do you think he'd know? You see what I'm saying? Let's hear the na-na thing. I think na 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 Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh. See, he's going to call back now, all pissed off, and I want him to know Opie hung up. I did not Opie hang up. Opie hung up. Guys, Clay, I would never do such a thing, Anthony. I like his radio phone idea. Da dun, da dun, dun, dun. <laughs> Dumps like a truck, truck, truck. Let me see a what, what, what. Oh. <laughs> Turn on your hot light. <laughs> Let it shine. Wait a minute. <laughs> uh, we can do a little radio thong idea. <laughs> He's priceless, man. I love the dice man. Waiting for him to call back. Rick, go call. You think like he calls right back? Oh, here he is. Like a Jew now. Here he goes. Okay. <laughs> What happened? Guys, what's wrong with your phone? I don't know. What happened? I don't know what happened. What happened over there? Do you want a cell phone? With who? Are you on a cell phone? With who? With us. No, I'm talking I'm talking to me now. I know, but you're in the middle of the na na thing. Yeah, maybe we'll get Bob Hope. Bob Hope? Yeah. Oh, uh, you seen him lately? He looks like Mr. Freeze from the He's yeah. been dead and back a thousand times, this guy. Yeah. He could do a few minutes for us. Entertain the troops? You know what I mean? Well, people are, are are digging the ideas. No, it's a, yeah, but they're going to think it's a it's a goof. The only way because it, of the way you're treating it. The only way it'll work though is if we get celebrities. Have you listened to our? We're going to get plenty. You want me to call my agent right now while we're on the phone? Uh no. Yeah, because he'll tell you the lineup. All right, one, give us the lineup. Mary, Mary, quite okay, contrary. Call him. Muslim women are so damn hairy. <laughs> oh, Anthony. Yeah, I'm, I'm trying to set this Thanks, up. Guys, it's an homage. Be a human being. I'm giving you an homage. Be a human being a minute. Yeah, I can't even do my stupid jokes on your stupid show because everything gets dumped. <laughs> You've been doing some great jokes on our yeah. yeah. No, what, what the the king joke? Right. You think that's really appropriate now that we all have to pull together as Americans? Yeah, that's, that's not good. I don't think that uh, nation's very sensitive right now. They should steer away yeah, from but, that. You, but that's our job. We we need to make them laugh. Let's leave. The we need to raise money. We need to make them laugh. Let's leave the midgets alone. Yeah, I, I'll do uh, like a clean, dirty joke. All right, guys. Okay. All right. All right. Well, uh, can you say pussy on the air? Uh, uh, only uh, only if it's a cat. All right. So we're talking about a, uh, a cat. So just you know, <laughs> <laughs> straight to poke my eye. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. No, it's, uh, and that's about a cat. Yeah, right. No, no that, right. they didn't buy that down the hall. I don't understand that. What do you mean they didn't buy it down the hall? Who's down the hall? Who's, who's, who's taking bites out of their pet? I mean, no. <laughs> it's just this. You get it? It's all about the cat. Right, uh, uh, well, uh, I got one. All right, I got it. All right. Uh, why don't chickens wear underwear? Is that good? <laughs> Is that a good one? No, that's not a good one. Can you can you play that one? No, you can't do that one. Either. All right, uh, <laughs> no, it's a good. How do you keep a bagel from getting away? Oh, you put rocks on it. <laughs> <laughs> hey, that's clean. Yeah, yeah. got a lamp, but it's clean. Yeah, yeah. Uh, one ocean say the other ocean. Huh. Nothing. They just waved. <laughs> <laughs> What do you what, 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 what do you have when you have two green balls in your hand? What? Kermit's undivided attention. You see what I mean? We gotta go back to the felt. You went too far. You see what I mean? It's gonna be all clean jokes like that. Hold on, let me. Uh, Joe wants in about the radio thon. Joe. Hey guys. Hey. You two had a great idea about this radio, uh, radio uh, telethon. Thanks, yeah. man. But Dice won't take this seriously. I what's, know. What's wrong with what's you, Dice? about me? You're making jokes about this like it's some little thing. I'm the It's my idea. I don't. I heard O and A come up with it first. What about you? Oh, 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 who came up with it first? Dice, we we've, we've been talking about this on the radio for the last three hours. You been because I told you about it, what? and I told you don't talk about it till I come on. I don't remember that. 
You don't remember that. We had a two and a half conversation last night over that thing there. Ask our listeners. Since three o'clock, we've been talking about a, a, a great idea we came up with called the radio thought. They know it's my idea. They know you're not smart enough to come up with that. <laughs> well, you want to ask them? No, I don't want. No. <laughs> don't start this. All right, I'll ask them. Who am I asking? <laughs> Joe. Yo. How long have we been talking about the Radiothon today? I would guess uh, since 3 o'clock. Yeah. That's really? my, that's my uh, approximate they, guess. They, they had to say it was my idea, right, Joe? No, they said it was Owen's idea. <laughs> Where, you know, Where are you office. from, Joe? It was lunchtime conversation. Where are you from? Jersey. Oh, well, you're not involved in the telethon, all right? Hang oh, up the phone. Well, why, why not? <laughs> because I said so. Wait, we're going to need all the help. We're going to need all the help. I'm sorry. Why do you hate Jersey? Hang the phone up, Jersey. Jersey. I just skank. don't like you for saying they didn't say me. Hang the phone up, you skank. All right, Jersey. Anthony, don't Hang go. the phone up, you skank. My mind. <laughs> Hang the phone up, you skank. Oh, I'm not going to argue with me. <laughs> I'm not going to argue with me today. Hang the phone up, you skank. No, you don't. You see, I'm not going to do that. Hang the phone up, you skank. Stop it. Don't talk to me like that. I'm over here now. Excuse me. I'm over here now. Hey, hey, brother, I'm over here now because you said I'm over here now. Oh, excuse me. I didn't know you were everybody. Look what I did to you again. Yeah, well, maybe I'll do it to you this time, big shot. <laughs> now, nice. nice. be nice. Now, be nice. You don't tell me to be nice. Why? Well, I came in here my lady, you nice. open your mouth, nice. and I do this I'm to you, and everybody goes what I say, and head, and then you hear this. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> I like the tape times. <laughs> I like the dice on tape. You like the dice on tape? Yeah. I don't even understand the way I talk. <laughs> nah, nah. Now they don't know if it's me or the tape. <laughs> You got so much stuff on me, you could just piece together conversations. Yeah. Look what I did to you again. <laughs> but let me do it with it. <laughs> Tell me when. All right. Hold on. All right, here I am. Mm -hmm. Hang the phone up, you no, not that out. one. Which one? The other thing. The other thing for you said what? About who? Oh, here now. You missed it, see? No. Can we get back to the end now? You know, everybody's going to think this is a goof. It's not going to be set up. You know what? And now that we talked about it, somebody else is going to do it, and you're going to look like idiots. All right, hold on. All right, uh, stop it now. All right, Vito. Let's hey, be people. Jerry Tice Lewis. These guys have been talking about last Tuesday while you were buried in a hole back in Hollywood. What are you talking about? Hey. This is my whole idea. <laughs> Um, thanks. Nice. Does it really matter who came up with the idea? Yeah. What do you want credit for it uh, after all this? No, I just want to get it not. done. Obviously, you're the one that wants credit because you keep going. We're talking uh, about nah, this nah. Rock. Uh, uh, nah, nah. Are you going to be wearing a tuxedo? No. Why not? Uh, this is this is this is a rock and roll telethon. A oh, rock and roll telethon. Yeah. What about the dong? This is the brawl for it all. Oh yeah. That's right. All right. We're going to get some heavy hitters on this. Who, who are we getting? I told you. You want me to call my guy? Yeah, no, give me some names off the top of your head. Yeah, we don't know anyone. Yes, you do. you got a lot of people. No. And we'll, we'll get an impressionist that does a thousand people. Don't worry about who we're going to get. We're going to do this. Now, when can we do it? Have you, haven't you been listening to our show for the last three years? We've never had anyone famous on this show. It's dice stock. Don't take the brown acid. Oh. <laughs> hey, I like dice stock. Dice stock. Uh, no, but we can't give me all the credit. I'm just the brains behind. No, we don't want to give you any. No, I know. I know how you are. All right. Believe me, I know you. All right. I know you better than you know you. All right. <laughs> Believe me, you don't even know who you are. All right. Who are we going to? What are you wearing? Wearing? Are you in a beige shirt today, my friend? No beige today. No beige. What are you wearing? Uh, green. Green, you make no statement. Don't have to. Yes, no, you do. Beige makes no statement. The joke don't work unless someone's wearing beige. No, no, it's green, it's beige, it's gray. <laughs> it don't matter what it is. I'm wearing a... It's uh, every color other than black. I'm wearing, black is the only color. I'm wearing a Gap green t-shirt. Gap, just the fact you bought it in Gap says, says, says what your life is about. You can't wear Everlast sweatshirts all the time, Don. Yes, you can, my friend. <laughs> all right, we got to take a break. Break from what? From this. Well, what are we going to do? Are we going to do this?
We need we need people. We're, we're going to get people. We're going to look stupid. We have a telethon, a <laughs> no, radio no telethon, and, and we, we so don't I, have anybody. I grew up with my heart in the right place and this idea in the right place. I got a gaffer from Fort Fairland. And, and Anthony keeps doing me. It's like I don't even want to do me anymore because this idiot just does me. <laughs> you don't want to do yourself anymore? No, I'm not doing me no more. <laughs> All right. I'm going to be Chris Walken from now on. All right, Dice, if you're so serious about the radio phone, have yeah. one of your big, big celebrity friends call us. Just so we have some confidence in your abilities to get these people aboard. Hey, you want a big celebrity? Yeah. I could get the little redhead kid from Different Strokes. <laughs> I was on that show. <laughs> All right, so you don't want to do this? We need to know who's going to be involved. Right. How many times I said we called a guy right now? Are you going to call, call some some of your mash friends? No. You, you, you want, want me to call the guy right now? Dice is a mash, you know. You want me to call the guy right now? He's an injured, injured soldier. Can we count on? Him? What's wrong with you? Can we count on Alan Alda? We're going to get everybody. I think everybody will want to be part of this. All right. Because well, this isn't a network uh, uh, nonsense show. You have our hotline. Get one this, one guy to call us. This is an immediate thing. Get one one big celebrity to call us. I got him right here. John Tra I got John Tra John, come here. Just say hello. Yeah, we're going to do the All right, get out of here, stupid. <laughs> John Travolta is going to be on with us. <laughs> do you hear him over there? Uh, no. I'm on the phone. I want to get... Get out of here. I'll give you a crack in the head. Hey, is uh, Stallone there? Everybody's here. Uh, Sly, Sly, fix your lip. Come here. Say something. You know, I think we all got to get together. Shut up, <laughs> stupid. That's pretty good, man. Yeah, yeah, that's good. Do something perfect. from Rocky. Whatever I do is perfect. Do, something, do, from, like... do something from Rocky. Something from Rocky. Yeah. What was that, like a as, movie? Yeah. yeah, as John Travolta. No. <laughs> <laughs> I, I can't beat him. All right, we didn't ask you to do it all day. <laughs> so you said you said do it as Travolta. Oh, it was? Yeah. All right. You said be Travolta and Rocky. Do walking. I, I can't do them. You did a good walking. All right. Are uh, there any girls in there? Are there any girls in there? <laughs> yeah. Then let me in. <laughs> do you have pecan ice cream? Yes. You have to say yeah when I when I. No, when I say something, yeah, you say no. Wait, wait till I ask you for something. <laughs> okay. All right. Do you have pecan ice cream? Yeah. Then let me have some. <laughs> <laughs> you see what I mean? How I do that? And people are gonna listen yeah. to this for twenty four straight hours. See, Jay Moore thinks he does the walk, and I do. He does Dean Martin. What? He does a great Dean Martin. How about Eric Roberts? Love the Eric Roberts. What's the matter here? Don't want to. <laughs> I don't oh, think you can say that. Hold on. That was too good. And they dumped out of that, my friend. Why they dumped out? Because you're describing something uh, in the uh, Das Dean Pierre. Yeah, do the, do the uh, Charlie, they took my thumb line. Oh, you want something from that? Well, you got to explain what you want. Eric Roberts from uh, uh, the Pope uh, from Greenwich. Uh, All right. Here we go. Let's All right. Eric Roberts. Dice, hold on, hold on. Right. Uh, die, die, wait, die. wait, 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 wait. You what? can't say the F in part. You can't say the F in part. So then I got to make something up fresh. You say F in. Let me tell you. I, I got I to gotta think of something he would do like. Just do the line. Which one? Tell me the line, About and I'll the, say it Charlie, again. Charlie, they took my effing thumb. Everyone, you know, oh, oh, I know what you, you meant. You can't say the F word. No, I know what you meant now. You meant like. Say effing. Like, say, um, like, uh, fungu or something. <laughs> Just don't say it at all. Just say they took my thumb. No, no, I got something. Leave it out. You know something, Charlie? Sometimes you got to whack them, you know? You say, you put your coat on and you don't say goodnight to nobody. <laughs> and that's just to humble them, Charlie. <laughs> Good Eric Roberts. No, but I see the bit I'm working on, they're all part of a vagina now. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Like all the impressions are part of uh, You're doing the Sarah vagina Jessica's monologues? vagina. <laughs> the vagina monologues. <laughs> you know? Like Eric Roberts is, uh, well, he was the he was the other thing I talked about. Right. Don't you say know what it. I mean? Don't say it. 
I'm not saying it. You're the one that pushed me into it. Welcome. I didn't want to get involved in that conversation. To the Andrew Dice Clay Telethon with stars <laughs> Lonnie Anderson, Mr. T, Andrea McArdle. Let me ask you this. Mr. T, Let me ask you this. <laughs> That's, me back. That's <laughs> funny. Let's not, Andrea McArdle. Let's not forget. Can't you guys get any, but you got to help out too. We don't have any celebrities with on the show. With Jamie Farr and J.P. Morgan. <laughs> you got a lot of celebrities that'll do this thing. You got that one. Radar. <laughs> You know, that one guy. Can we count on Radar from your match yeah. day? Radar O'Reilly, could you get him? What's he doing these days? I don't know. You know what? The way you guys <laughs> acting on the air, you won't be doing nothing tomorrow. What are you talking about? The people are going to get very mad at you. This is this is not a joke. Oh, right? stop it. Bring uh, Just have one of these big celebrities uh, call us. so we know. Yeah, we'll set up the whole thing. I'm not having no big... I just had a few guys on with you. Who? I, you know who you were talking to, like. So, so people are going to donate money for 24 hours straight radio of you, uh, you know doing impressions. You donate money anyway. No matter who's on, we'll be on. We're going to have a lot of laughs. You're going to sing some Elvis. Right on, baby. <laughs> are you going to dress up like Elvis? Yes. You'll do whatever it takes, right? Yeah. Uh, It'll be like a pre-Christmas thing. That's a true American. You know what I mean? All right. Yeah. I went, <laughs> can you use that? No. That, you know what? For that day, they're going to have to give us a waiver on language also. Yeah, Dice, you can't say half the stuff. See, it's, no, it's not a No, we're not going to curse. It's, it's all going to be nice. It's the dirty language. Uh, this, this is something we, we should really do and, and do it the right way without without goofing around. All right. You and know now I'm I mean? bringing on a big star, the cameraman from Casual Sex. <laughs> <laughs> Anthony, I'll give you your address in Brooklyn. <laughs> Don't make me give you your address in Brooklyn. I moved. Nice. I know where you moved. That's why I have the address. Ah, uh, na, na. Ah, uh, na, 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 na. Chris is saying this is his best idea since Brain Smasher. <laughs> I liked Brain Smasher. Yeah. Who cares if you don't? All right, let's like, go. All right, so what do we do now? Got to work out the details. Call your guy, see who you can get. You want me to call him right now? Yeah, call Yeah, after you hang up with us. No, no, I could get him in one second. Ah, uh, nah, nah. <laughs> you go. Now we say goodbye to you. It goes Dice. Holy crap. Uh, we have to take we a actually break. have a great relationship with Dice. We like the Dice, man. No, no, no. How much fun dueling dice. I love it. It's fun. <laughs> dueling dice. Right? <laughs> uh, we got to take a, a little bit of a break, huh? <laughs> All right. Yeah. yeah. Haven't broken in about an hour. We'll be back. Okay. I'm the dick. No. Anthony. I'm an ass. Why are you wasting your time with this sleazy trap?